so let me start with patience. Hopefully we, we believe that Harmony will support a better care for patients, including uh, uh, improvement in therapy and uh, care of patients. And uh, for physicians, we hope uh, to develop some tool that can help a physician for diagnosis and prognosis of patients. And last but not least, uh, uh, there is also a, a great uh, contribution to the computational community uh, because uh, the, the problems raised by harmony, hematological malignancies, etc., are stimulating the computational community, because I am a computational guy, to develop new methods for working uh, with this uh, kind of data. So this is very important, not all of course, patients and physicians are the most important, but also is very stimulating for computational community and artificial intelligence. You know, the data sharing is, uh, especially in the European, uh, in the European framework, is not, is not easy. But Harmony developed, uh, let's say, a pipeline that now is widely accepted, and there is this mechanism of uh, de facto anonymization and the honest broker. The honest broker is taking the data from the data provider and is giving the data to the harmonization guy. And after this, the data are in the platform and we can analyze this data. So there are obstacles. Uh, the GDPR is really strict and also each state has also their own G GDPR. So it's com but this pipeline has been accepted by the European community. Mm -hmm.